if more men were vocal about the bullshit that they experienced while being in a relationship with some of these women, I promise y'all, y'all would view this shit a little different. See, a lot of men just take them L's in private. And you'll never hear about it because it's like, bro, we just gonna move on with our life, you feel me? A lot of women know who their friends are as a mother, as a friend, as an auntie, as a cousin. A lot of y'all don't know who your friends are as a lover and somebody to be in a relationship with. A lot of these women out here be mentally unstable. They lack emotional intelligence. They be self-centered. They be selfish as hell. A lot of these women out here be abusive. If not physical, then verbal, mentally, financially, just abuse. They be cheaters. They be liars. And since we don't ever say nothing, they get the luxury of telling the story however they want that story to go. A lot of men that went through the bullshit, I promise you. And they gonna get in the comments and say, oh, go heal, go heal. I promise you, if more men went to therapy, ain't none of these therapists gonna tell us that we need to be out here paying all y'all bills, putting up with y'all bullshit, and give all our love to somebody that don't love us back. That's crazy. My therapist ain't telling me to do none of that. <laughs> But yeah, I want y'all to understand there's a lot of men out here that tried to do right and still want to do right. That's why most of us don't give a damn about the 4B movement and all the decentering men and shit. That shit don't, that don't bother us not one bit. Because we get to keep our money and stay away from the bullshit. Y'all sign me up.